All right, guys. My name is Jason. This is Old Car Guy's version of the America Bumper to Bumper Challenge. If you don't know who America Bumper to Bumper is, I'm going to leave a link right here so you can go and check out my buddy Kip, whose YouTube channel is America Bumper to Bumper. And the reason why we're doing this challenge is to get his channel to 1,000 subscribers. I hope you will go over and subscribe to him. We've got four minutes and 30 seconds left to get through this challenge, so let's get started. First vehicle I ever owned was an 83 Dodge D100, 78 Chevy Malibu, 89 Plymouth Sundance, 81 Dodge Aries, which I traded the Sundance for with my sister. My first square body, an 82 Chevy C10. Uh, then I bought the 79 Chrysler Cordoba that I call the Mopar. Um, 97 Pontiac Grand Am, which I bought at the dealership I was working at at the time, nicknamed the Enterprise. Uh, then it was the 89 Mercury Topaz, 94 GMC Sonoma Red, which was one of my favorite vehicles of all time. First vehicle I ever lowered and put some wheels on. Second square body was an 85K10 uh, truck. Uh, then it was a 97 Dodge Neon, 92 Buick Regal, 89 Dodge Spirit, 91 Dodge Dynasty, 77 Chevy Caprice, 84 Crown Victoria, which was my grandfather's. Um, it wasn't much of a car, I tell you what. I'll see if I can find a picture of it. Uh, after that, it was the 95 Nissan Pathfinder to flip, which I did. 99 Ford Explorer, Eddie Bauer edition. And then the uh, 96 Chevy S10 and the 97 Ford Ranger we bought when my wife started her courier job that we got from a family friend. Uh, from then on, after those two vehicles, she started using minivans, So, uh, which we'll get to here in a few. So then there was a 90 F-150 extended cab, two-wheel drive. 98 Dodge Neon Black, two-door coupe, 87 Chevy C10 Blue, uh, my first fuel injected, it had the 4.6 liter V6, sorry, 4.3 liter V6, which I had to rebuild, it had a bottom end uh, engine knock, um, 2001 Pontiac Montana, 97 Plymouth Voyager, two different 01 Toyota Sienna vans, and that's when we got kind of hooked on the Toyota Sienna vans, but we did opt out for a couple of rounds with a Dodge Grand Caravan, and uh, which was an 07, and then an 05 black one. 09 Chevy Uplander, 08 Pontiac Montana, and then the 06 Toyota Sienna Blue that we put over 600,000 kilometers on. Um, great vehicle, uh, one, of my, one of my favorite vans that we ever owned. After that, it was the Hyundai Veloster, which now Junior has. Uh, after the Veloster, we bought Bubbles, and Bubbles was a winter driver, a winter beater that we bought simply knowing that once we got to 2,000 subscribers, we were going to blow that sucker up, and we did. And if you haven't seen that video, I'm going to put a link right here. You're not going to want to miss that. We're going to do it again, as long as I can get my channel to 5,000 subscribers before the end of this year. We're going to blow up a PT Cruiser. Uh, after Bubbles was Grandma, which is sitting over here right now. Uh, my wife is daily driving that and then currently we have the 77 c10 that we call dale so while i'm editing this video i realized that i did not follow the rules of the bumper to bumper challenge that basically myself and grant tommy put together so the first one is the car that i've owned the longest obviously is the 79 chrysler cordoba and the car that is seems to be the most significant to me at the moment well I would have to say it's Dale. I've had three square bodies prior to Dale, and this one is the one that really means the most to me. It's the first full project, engine transmission, suspension, all that, no bodywork. I'm keeping it original. So there we go. That completes my bumper bumper challenge. Again, if you have not gone over to Kip's YouTube channel, which is America Bumper to Bumper, I hope you do. His link will be in the description box down below and I hope you subscribe and show him some love because we're trying to get his channel to the 1,000 subscriber mark. Having said all that, guys, we are at the end of this video. Thank you for watching. I can't wait to see yours. So let's do it again in another video. Stay focused on the windshield, not the rearview mirror. I love you guys. God bless.